Dude, that's a whale without a tail.
So basically here on this dive, um, I'm dropping down to the bottom and it's fairly deep. Um, just trying to reach the sand floor there, check things out. I had switched the GoPro around. I was done spearing fish for a little while. And uh, see the bottom, don't see anything right off the bat. I'm starting to come back up. Well, meanwhile, that sea lion was up on top. He had grabbed my fish and he was uh, chowing down on him. And as you go up, the camera catches him right there chowing on my fish so i'll come to the top of the surface right here get a breath of air and i'm looking around i see a bunch of thrashing on top of the water and first thing i thought of was a shark like oh my god a shark's got my fish there, there's my eyes like oh shark then i realize oh it's a sea lion okay I don't feel so bad now grab the rope and i start trying to jerk the um, rope out of the sea lion's mouth and he just starts thrashing the water and you're gonna see all this like foam and stuff in the water. Bunch of air bubbles, let's see here. They ought to be coming up right somewhere. Anyway, some air bubbles are coming up here. And then the dang thing just started like uh, towing me offshore. And so like I'm pulling back, pulling back. Um, the fish is attached to a rope which is attached to my spear gun, um, my Pathos sniper spear gun and a GoPro Hero 10. So the last thing I was going to do was let go of all that stuff just so a sea lion could swim off with it. So anyhow, it was a, it was a little bit of a tussle, but um, got everything back. And uh, one of the fish ripped off of the stringer. And when it did, I pulled the fish to me. Then the dang sea lion uh, went down um and came up right underneath me and hit me in the side of the leg and about then is about the time i crawled up on the rock you're going to see me crawling up on a rock here in a minute and uh, i waited oh i waited a couple minutes i didn't see him around so then i uh, just jumped back in the water and went back to spear fishing um but there was a whole lot of hollering going on that i'm surprised the gopro didn't pick up while i was uh while it was under the water and i was on top uh screaming at the sea lion but yeah, here I am, um, back on the rock. There's my fish. They're all kind of mangled. A little bit of road rash going on there with the fish. Strap my GoPro back on and uh, jump back in the water. And back to my beautiful day. So right here, I'm actually kind of looking around like, okay, I want to make sure that thing's not going to come up behind me. I uh, kind of scanned the bottom a little bit. Uh, didn't see him. There are some fish. There's some fish right there. I'll film you, man. Fish everywhere.
We're gonna film you, man. Hey, you can start over if the sea lion grabs your fish. <laughs> Woohoo! Because it, it's not getting me. Okay? Because I'm looking at the camera. Alright. Welcome back to Yak Adventures. And I hope you enjoyed that uh, little bit of skin diving that I did. And uh, this isn't working. We're making fun of it. So we'll try it again. I haven't said anything. Yeah, I know. Okay, move in a little closer because because that thing has poor volume. I can't see. Okay, come a little closer. And then, if you... Well, hey, welcome back to Yak Adventures. And if you got this far in the video, then you've been watching uh, me and my buddies do some spear fishing. Uh, had a little encounter with a sea lion, grabbed my fish tried to pull me out to the ocean a little further than I wanted to go and uh, anyhow this is not working what should I say 
Hey, if you got this far in the video, um, just want to say real quick that that was the first time I used a uh, GoPro 10 and uh, underwater. It's kind of a challenge doing that. And on top of that, I had that encounter with the sea lion. That was kind of fun and scary. It's all at the same time. I wouldn't say it was fun, but definitely wasn't going to let my fish get away. So anyhow, I uh, hope you enjoy the channel.